The universe is huge. There are trillions of planets out there. So, where the hell are the aliens? Seriously, we've sent satellites, telescopes, and even a golden record into space basically screaming, Hey, we're here! Come say hi! And yet, silence. No flying saucers, no little green men, not even a single We Come In Peace postcard. So, what's going on? Is the universe empty? Are we alone? Or, is there a much darker reason why we haven't found aliens yet? Let's start with the obvious. Statistically, aliens should exist. There are an estimated 100 billion galaxies in the universe. Each galaxy has billions of stars, and a huge percentage of those stars have planets orbiting them. That's trillions of planets, many of them in the habitable zone, meaning they could support life. If life happened here on Earth, it should have happened elsewhere too, right? Well, that brings us to Fermi's paradox. Fermi's paradox, where is everybody? Back in the 1950s, physicist Enrico Fermi asked a simple question. If the universe is so big and life is so probable, then where is everybody? Because if intelligent alien civilizations exist, at least one of them should have colonized the galaxy by now. But we see nothing. No signals, no spaceships, no intergalactic McDonald's. This is the paradox. Aliens should be everywhere, but we don't see them anywhere. And there are some truly wild theories to explain this. Theory 1. The Great Filter Something is stopping civilizations from advancing. One terrifying explanation? Every civilization eventually gets wiped out. This is called the Great Filter. The idea is that at some point in evolution, there's a massive, almost impossible barrier that stops life from reaching an advanced stage. So either life is extremely rare, and we somehow beat the odds, or... Every advanced civilization destroys itself before it becomes interstellar. Maybe it's nuclear war, climate change, rogue AI, or something even worse. But the theories suggest that civilizations get so advanced that they eventually create their own doom. And if you think this sounds crazy, just remember, we almost nuked ourselves out of existence during the Cold War. If Earth had just a few bad days in history, we might not even be here to ask these questions. Theory 2. The Zoo Hypothesis. We're being watched. Now, let's get weird. What if aliens know we exist, but they're ignoring us? Imagine an anthill next to a highway. The ants don't know what a car is, who built the road, or that humans even exist. We're just too advanced for them to comprehend. Now flip it. What if we are the ants, and aliens are so advanced that they don't even bother talking to us? Or worse, they are watching us but treating us like an intergalactic zoo. Maybe there's an entire alien civilization watching us, like a reality show called Dumb Humans Doing Dumb Things. And before you laugh, consider how much humans love watching wildlife documentaries. What if aliens are doing the same thing to us, studying us like we study animals? Theory 3. The Dark Forest. Maybe we should be glad we haven't found them. Now here's a truly terrifying idea. What if the universe is quiet? because it's a deadly game of survival. This is called the Dark Forest Hypothesis. Imagine the universe as a dark, silent forest. Every civilization is a hunter, hiding in the shadows. Why? Because revealing your location could get you killed. Think about it. When humans discovered new lands, we didn't always greet the locals with hugs and cookies. History is filled with conquests, invasions, and annihilation. So maybe, just maybe, every alien civilization is hiding, afraid that if they make noise, something much more powerful will hear them and wipe them out. And here we are, blasting radio signals into space, basically yelling, hey, anyone out there? If this theory is true, we might want to stop that. Theory 4. What if we are the aliens? Now for a totally different idea. What if humans are the aliens? What if life on Earth didn't originate here but was planted millions of years ago by another civilization? Maybe an ancient alien race seeded life across different planets and we're just another experiment in their cosmic Petri dish. And if that's true, maybe they're still watching us. Final twist. Maybe they've already found us. Now here's the really scary thought. Maybe aliens have found us and they just don't want us to know. Think about UFO sightings, government cover-ups, and mysterious disappearances. What if they've been watching us this whole time, deciding when or if they'll make contact? Or worse, what if they're already among us? If you feel like someone is staring at you right now, you might not be wrong. And here's a thought. If aliens did make contact, would humans even handle it well? Or would we immediately start arguing, fighting, or trying to monetize alien selfies? Maybe that's why they're keeping their distance. So, what do you think? Which theory makes the most sense to you? The Great Filter. Civilizations destroy themselves before they go interstellar. The Zoo Hypothesis. Aliens are watching us like a reality show. The Dark Forest. Aliens are hiding because the universe is dangerous. What if we are the aliens? Humans were planted here by an advanced civilization. Or, they've already found us. Comment below what you think is the real answer. And if you enjoyed this video, hit subscribe before an alien government deletes this channel.